Hi everyone, this is Helen, the youngest sister from Three Years Apart, and today I'm giving you a, a haul video, part one I guess, or one haul of many to come soon, because Amy and I, we went on this long shopping spree, because all these stores are having so many clearances, because it's after Christmas, it's after all the holidays, and they're making room for all of the spring stuff. So. Instead of, oh, I must, since I am filming most of my videos within the next two days, I'm going to have this, I guess, scratch on my finger. I'm sorry if it bothers anyone. It looks worse than it actually is. I work with my hands a lot, so there's always going to be a scar or a scratch somewhere. If it grosses anyone out, just comment down below, and I'll be sure to cover it up next time. But it just doesn't need a band-aid. That's why I don't have one. But if it does bother you, I completely understand. You just tell me in the comments down below. So instead of doing like Hobby Lobby haul part one, part two to make the video shorter, I, w I decided to combine most of the products I got from different stores, like similar product products like stickers and washi tape, into one video. So if you want to only see where I got the washi tape, or if you only want to see where I got certain pens or whatever, then you can just refer to that video. Um, yeah, I think this might be better in some ways, but let me know if you prefer like Michael's haul, like a hauls by stores rather than, or a big long collective haul rather than separated into small haul, small little videos. Whichever you prefer, I want to make this more enjoyable for you to watch and easier for you to find things, so just let us know. First, I'm going to start off by craft storage, or any type of storage really, but I like containers, Amy and I love containers, so I'm going to start off the one little one that's not from Hobby Lobby. This is actually from Michael's. It's seasonal, It's but I have seen it almost every spring of part of the spring floral line I should say. So this is a wooden box, wooden planter. Oh this is for the summer. Whoa. <laughs> it's only February. I saw this in December and it's for summer. Wow. Anyway. So this was um four dollars. But we did have a coupon for thirty percent off all regular price items so we did get this with a 30% off coupon. I'm not going to use it to plant anything in it or for, or even for fake floral arrangements. I'm actually going to put some things like pens most likely, maybe some scissors or any little tidbits like that because I have I like to decorate with my pens rather than flowers so but I might put like a succulent or something like that in here. We'll see. But I know I'm going to use this a lot. So, oops, I hit the tripod, I'm sorry. So the next one is, from here on out, will be from Hobby Lobby, because they had the most clearance, you guys. It was yellow tags everywhere, and it was amazing, and I had, like, no self-control. But this is from, it's a brand name, so that's why it's so expensive, but these are art bins, stackable art bins, that are shorter as they tear up. But these are regular price fourteen dollars, but they were on clearance for three forty nine, three dollars and fifty cents. And this is what I would actually pay for, right? Rather than like I wouldn't even pay like eight bucks for this. To be honest, there's a little gnat in here. I'm gonna like, ugh. <laughs> it's fine. It's just a little friend. But yeah, this is. I think Amy's gonna use this, so. I'm not going to open it up I just, in case she wants to save it or whatever she wants to do. But yeah, this is such a good deal. I also saw this at Michael's, I believe, for even more expensive. But I'm not sure. Anyway, you can find this at M Michael's and Hobby Lobby, but try to get them out there still for $3.50. Next, this guy we found in the actual clearance section. And there is a scratch down here, and it's missing one of its little clear leg peg button bump. Bump. It's a clear bump. It's called a bump, right? It is missing that, but 
Um, Amy and I have always loved pilot bowls, even before like the whole summer, like outside of summer, because of the TV show Psych. Woohoo if you're a Psych fan. <laughs> so pilot bowls are like our weakness for decor and all these things because we're just quote Psych from then on. But it is not in perfect condition to be expected when it's clearance. But Amy still picked it up and I think it's pretty cute too. It was originally $12, but now we got it for $3. And to be honest, you can get replacements for these little bumps anywhere for like a whole pack for maybe $3 itself. And I think that's a better choice anywho. Sorry if you hear like plastic bags because I am surrounded by shopping bags and I reuse plastic bags. No one, nobody worry. So next, what I'm really excited about, oops, are these. So these are just acrylic trays, clear acrylic, acrylic trays. It's being marketed as decorative or washi tape storage, which like I can, so you can see my umbrella lights. If you're curious what lights I use, I use umbrella lights. Anyway, so yeah. I might use one of these for washi tape stores because you'll see in the washi tape video which when it's up I will link on card for you but I may be able to use one of these for washi tape but honestly I most likely will use something else that I'm not afraid to scratch up for washi tape it's, even though it's just tape I like to move my tape around a lot and Knowing me, I'm gonna scratch something. Anyway, so this was, these are sold for 20 bucks. Like, I understand that acrylic storage is really expensive, especially since they're in high demand, because they're really popular to store things, and I can see why, because you can see everything. But I'm honestly going to get it to probably store other things, like maybe makeup in here, I'm not sure. But we got these for five dollars each, so this would have cost for all three. It would have cost thirty dollars, but we got it for fifteen. No, whoa! I can't. Whoa, math. My math was wrong. Two twenty times three is sixty. So sixty dollars, but we got this for fifteen. <laughs> I was like, wait, thirty dollars? That's like half off, and this is definitely more than half off. I can do it. I can do that. I promise. So that's all that decor. Now we get to more, I guess, aesthetics decor. So I like love the world map. It's one of my favorite prints or just geographic. So especially if it's like looks antique and I definitely pulled Amy into that because I wanted to do, wanted to decorate the office and our mantle and everything with a bunch of world maps and globes and all that stuff, travel items, and so this went perfectly with that theme. All of the wooden and metal decor was actually, I believe, 40 or 50% off. We bought these on the first week of February, so... It might not be on sale when you see this video, but these are like year-round items, so and they always there's always a sale on them, at least once a month, I would say. So these are just simple plain wooden boxes, and you can store anything like more washi tape or even like special bits, like say fountain ink. Or ink cartridges for fountain pens and like you don't want them to get ruined or anything but you don't know where to put it to, so it won't ruin anything else you can put it in these tiny cute little boxes and they're just adorable Amy got these for herself to decorate her room because we're redoing everything right now I swear but I love them as well next I got this this is, I think, a letter sorter? Home Decor 2017 tray is what it says. <laughs> and it has a little label holder here. 
I like love galvanized metal and um I guess worn in wood look like my entire room is in that theme and I just don't know why it makes my creativity juices flowing but this was part of their oh yeah this is so this is a metal decor so there was also part of that previous sale I mentioned 40 or 50 percent off so it was all regular, regularly twenty dollars but 40 or 50 off of that and I do have a plan for this I don't just buy things because I think it's well home decor I try not to buy them in the containers just because I think they're cute but I really like it now this these are my absolute favorite purchases um home decor wise look at that they're so cute oh. <laughs> I meant to show you the back, I just for some reason forgot that these drawers can be pulled out. But they are small, these are fairly new because I kind of, I think I was, she was, an employee was putting these out or maybe rearranging the items while I was shopping there. I tried not to be in her way, <laughs> but she was really nice about it. So these are regularly... $20 each for this whole unit here, but their spring collection, and I'm pretty sure it's going to continue to be on sale from now on until they're out. So it was on sale for 50% off, so I got these each for $20. So it was, it's nice. As you can see, the whole galvanized metal with the wood, and these little tiny drawers. I almost like jumped at these when I saw them. Uh, we were about to leave too. I was like, okay, I think we're done. I don't need any more like giant metal containers. And I saw these and they're so cute. I'll find a use for them because I have a lot of little tidbits. Like, you know those big paper clips or something like that? That don't fit in anything because they're big. I'll probably put those in here. And look how cute they are standing side by side. Oh my gosh. So I believe that's everything for home decor. Um, for your crafts and all that stuff. Thank you guys for watching and stay tuned for the other videos of these hauls. Bye guys.